Hey, what's up guys? This is Tom from Chalk5. Welcome back to No Man's Sky. This is episode 3, and as you can see, I've just been doing a bit of off-camera work. Not a lot, really. I've just been mining a bit more of that, um... Th what is it called? Thamium? Th uh, oh, her Heridium. Man, I always think that's Thamium for some reason. Because as you can see, the, the total value of that stuff is really good. What on earth? <laughs> Ships are flying over. Wow. Um, I also just spotted these, like, butterfly bird things, which I have scanned. And that's them right there. Uh, off camera as well, like, you know, away from the game, I've been doing quite a bit of research. Well, I say quite a bit, not that much, but I've been sort of brushing up on my knowledge of No Man's Sky and the sort of things that I have to do in No Man's Sky. And apparently, like, the... the the aim of the whole game is to get to the center of the galaxy, which sounds like really cool. Um, or at least that, I, I think that's like the aim of the game. <laughs> I don't really know. But apparently like you can rename planets and you can rename animals and stuff like that. So maybe we'll get into that here in the future. If you guys like want to leave name suggestions for any like crazy looking animals or strange planets that we find, then feel free to do that in the comments below and I, I'll do it like next episode. Because um, I think a few of you guys are really enjoying this sort of series already, so that's really cool. Um, now what I was doing then, obviously, was just collecting some uh, heridium, and I filled upon a bit of plutonium, a bit of carbon, and I've absolutely filled the ship with heridium, as you can see. And one of the other things that I found out when I was doing a bit of research was the different colours. So as you can see, like these are like this, like, I don't know what you call that, like pastel green... Um, and then like the yellow, and then like the red, the blue, and then purple. Now, purple is the most expensive, so purple is like really rare, and it does say at the top, look, um, pugnium, uh, neutral element, rare. And then, I'm not sure if blue... Well, judging by how much it costs, the gold is apparently really rare. Um, so, maybe we'll stock up on some gold before we go. Um, but I don't know how I'd actually do that unless I get rid of that. Can I, have I got any thamium in my, uh, no. Oh, I found some more nanite clusters as well. Back at that last drop off, which I'll probably go to in a second and we can save the game before I like leave this planet. Um, I, I've unlocked that machine that was like broken and it, I thought it was going to turn into like one of them scanner things and instead it just, uh, how do I take off again? Oh, there we go. It wasn't... Hold R2 take off. Oh, there we go. There we go. <laughs> I literally just did it and I've forgotten already. Um, but yeah, I thought it was going to be something else and it turned out to just be that, so... I thought it was going to be one of them scanning machines. Anyway, this little question mark just popped up, so we need to check this out. Uh, I don't know what it is. Oh, slow down, slow down. <laughs> I haven't been, like, very far yet, so I'm saving it pretty much for all the camera work. But apparently... And judging by the look of it, this might be <gasps> an alien thing. They're, they're apparently like there's these like alien tablets and monuments and stuff, and then they help you like to unlock a word in a language. Here we go. Neriditans restless sleep interact. Huh. Okay, let's do it. Whoa, Neridian's Rostrosis, the imprint of an ancient civilization, was once absorbed by the strange marker. The story of the Viking somehow spills out in the language of my own people. The noble travelers will be spared. Their journey through the cosmos shall be not be thwarted, so it is decreed. The will of Hirik commands it. The Viking shall honor the judgment and the belief of the ancients. Here we go, then. My knowledge of the Viking increases. There we go then. That's this is one of the things I like I found out about. So your standing with the Viking has increased. Wow, that's really good. So now I don't know if that means we'll like be able to understand You know like when we go to the, the space station, which I, I do want to do like here in a bit. I don't know if that means I'll be able to uh, understand them more. Oh, oh, can I get out of here? Oh god, that was close. Oh man, those are nasty looking things. Is that the same one? It is, yeah. Um, so that's one thing we have to do, and then we also have to, like, keep an eye out for outposts. Obviously, Knowledge Stone, this one is one as well. 
Oh, there we go. So there we've we've learned the Viking word for visual. All right, cool. Okay, so that was worth me like looking into that. Otherwise, I would have just been like, "What on earth is this?" So that's one thing. The outposts are basically like save points, and they act like the ship and stuff like that. In fact, I'll leave a link to the video that I watched about this sort of stuff uh, on YouTube. In if you click that I in the top right hand corner, then that'll take you to it. Uh, there's some gold there. I was just sort of wondering if we could see any more outposts or anything. Pretty interesting to see. Uh, nope. Oh god, <laughs> get up a bit. I, I don't. I still don't know what happens if you actually crash your ship. But like I said, apparently like gold and stuff's really rare. So we were pretty l lucky to find this like planet with just an abundance of gold on the surface. Uh, I don't know what that is. Just a tree. Um, let's just look around. See, look, there's gold and stuff there as well. Look, look at it. It's just everywhere. Which is really good. Oh my god, what is that? Oh, what is that? That's like the No Man's Sky logo thing. <gasps> Hang on, let's land here, guys. Initiating landing sequence. Let's get out and have a look. Let's investigate. Oh. <gasps> I didn't see that um, question mark appear, though. Oh, wow, look at it. Wow. All right, now we're getting somewhere. Now I feel like we're actually doing something. Um, dreams of Flag of Cast. Interact. Okay, let's, let's go. What is going to happen? Dreams of Flag of Cast. I place my palm on the monolith, then stand back when it melts in response to my touch. Molten rock drips down the stone, exposing a hollow interior. Inside, I see riches that are beyond belief, ancient technologies and cargo that would aid my journey. Lava continues to drop, and the edifice seems unstable, but equipment that could aid me is within arm's reach. Suddenly, the voice of an ancient tribe shakes the ground I stand on. Oh, we got rid of the dagger! We could have used it for this! Oh, man! What should I do? Should I reach in or stand back? Suddenly the voice of an ancient tribe shakes the ground I stand on. <laughs> I kind of want to reach in. Do you guys want to reach in? Yeah, I feel like we should stand back, but I want to reach in. Let's reach in. The molten monolith collapses onto my exosuit. The edifice is reconstructed. The damage remains. Oh, man! Oh, it decreased! Oh, no! Ah oh, man, shouldn't have done that. Shouldn't have done that. Oh no, should we like reload? We could do that. All right, guys, I'm back. Right, let's. So it's not done it. <laughs> Let me know if you guys like. If you guys aren't cool with me cheating, then I won't do it. But for right now, I just sort of want to. What is this thing? Knowledge stone. Oh wow. You have learned the Viking word for detection. Oh, are there any more? Are these all of them, or...? Word for warp. Well, that's pretty good, because we need a warp drive, so <laughs> it might help us. Valking word for Viking. Vi Vi I said Vulcan, then no, Vi Viking. Milestone accomplished. Wow! <laughs> Babbler, learn five words. Okay, that's pretty cool. Right, so... Like, let me know what you guys think about Reloaded. I won't do it in the future if you don't want me to. But for right now, let's just see what actually happens. Because this is the first one. Like, I have no idea. We're learning. Uh, oh, so oh, so there's one of the words we know now. Look, Dom Viking, and then something, something else. Right, right. Let's stand back. Ancient warriors who once worshipped. Uh, bless my show of respect. Nothing found. Oh, right. So no <laughs> basically, nothing happened anyway. Ah, man, if we had that dagger, though, and I give it to somebody, damn! That's because I didn't know what I was doing. Well, that's the importance of knowledge. Anywho, let's, um... I don't know what you guys, like, want to do, but I, I kind of fancy going back to the space station, selling, like, all my stuff, and then that'd be it. Like, we'd be good. Let's just check... 
Now, it did say on that video, the, the aim of the game is to manage your storage. So, we really need to keep an eye on everything that we're using, and then hopefully it will be fine. Um, if I use the rest of my plutonium, we could mine some more gold. Ooh, yeah. Okay, get rid of that. Uh, oh, that's because it didn't fully charge, is it? Yeah, it must be. Right, so we can use some um, thamium as well, because... You know, we've not got much of that. And if we can use that up, that will free up another space. Right, I'm getting the hang of it now, guys. I think. <laughs> I think. Uh, so let's use this hammer. I did use one of my power cells earlier. But let's do that. And the good thing is, like, this planet, it's a really good planet. Because we don't have to... It's not making us use our, like, suit. So that's not costing us, like, any energy to live here. Like, it's... It's okay. Ooh. Destroy... Exocraft craft mining laser required. Okay, but because that's purple, you see, that's going to be like really expensive, whatever that is. So that's good to know. Right, let's uh, let's mine a bit more gold. We can put it on the ship, and well, in fact, we could just mine as much as we can like carry. Put the rest on the ship, and then keep going until we can carry that much. So let's do that. Oh God, wrong one. My bolt caster. No, nope, don't want some of my ship. Uh, what? Why is it? Huh, why won't it let me change to my mining tool? Normally I just come in here and then change it to this. Let's try the uh, photo mode as well. Uh, oh wow, am I like flying? Oh wow, what? Oh, okay, that's bizarre. <laughs> I wasn't really expecting it. Oh man, that's a beautiful shot. Look at that. Oh, wow. Um, share to take screenshot. Oh, man, what did that say? I was just reading that. Hide menu, move sun. Move sun? What? Change camera mode, change settings. Let's take a screenshot. I've never actually done this, so let's just press share. And there we go. Screenshot. Save a screenshot and share it with your favorite social media. Okay, I might try that out later. Okay. Uh, where do you want to share it? Twitter. <laughs> Can I actually do this? I've never done this, so <laughs> maybe I'll cut this bit out. <laughs> okay, guys, so I've just posted it on my Twitter account. So if you want to go check that out or give me a follow, I'll put it up on the screen. And you can see where to find me. Um, <laughs> I've never like done anything like that before, so it was quite interesting. Oh, man, why am I... Why can I not? Well, let's charge it up, but why can I not change over to my mind? Now my bolter casting's gone as well, what? Hmm. That's interesting. Strange. Uh, well anyway, let's, let's go back to space. <laughs> let's go to the, uh, Back to the space station. Is there like a map on this? That's one thing I don't. I don't know. No, no, close to six. No. Uh, navigation and discovery. Finding resources. Planetary. New features. Uh, combat. Trading. Hmm. Oh, there's the portal glyphs. Look. So that must take you to there. But how do I. Log, journey. Um, oh, it tells me like almost how much I've travelled and stuff. Can I set like a waypoint to one of these? Oh wow, look, these are the animals we found. Oh wow, that gives you a better view of them. We need to go back to that other planet and like scan them as well because I I never did that. So what is this? It's covered by that. Uh. I don't know what the... Hmm. And what is that? Celestial bodies, five planets. Oh, that's the galaxy ruin. Right. But where's the... Oh, I don't know. Let's just go. Let's just go and go back up. Go back into space. Casual as heck. And then... Oh, wow! Oh, wow! The spaceships are right here. Unknown planet there. 
Wow, let's just go and check these guys out. I don't know if we can actually, like, shoot these or what, but... Hmm. Or if, <laughs> if it's even a good idea to shoot them. I don't know. Uh, we're still quite a way off. It seems to, like... Oh, there we go. I have no idea whether it's like a good idea to shoot these or not. Destroy. All oh, right, so yeah, we can destroy them lot and then get whatever from them. Oh god. I don't know what it's telling me it's bad, but um I think I just saw the space station thing there. Yeah, there it is. Oh man. Flying all over the place. I I need, really need to get used to these controls. Let's go back to the space station. And I'll probably just skip this part out and then I'll see you guys back there. And then we can like sell all of our stuff and hopefully get enough credits to buy like hyperdrive. So I'll see you guys here in a second. Oh! Oh jeez! Oh god guys, I thought I was gonna crash! No! 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 Oh no! I don't know what's happening. Oh man! I don't know if we just like tapped the spaceship or what? Space station. Ah, uh, is this a different one? I don't think so. Just boost ahead over here. Okay, I need to find the entrance. There it is. Nice. Oh my god, I really thought I was gonna. <laughs> I really thought I was gonna crash. Okay, take control. There we go. See, it just does this by itself. So that's why it suddenly went to like awesome pilot instead of me. <laughs> okay, so. It, we didn't. Uh, <laughs> that way was the other guy who we gave our dagger to, who I wish I hadn't done it now, but never mind, whatever. And then this way was that like trade terminal port. Okay, so let's go see if we can like sell this stuff. I'm hoping this is right. I didn't actually like look into this, so. Login terminal. Um, what is all this? Words collected. Five. Oh, alien colonists encountered. One. Most units acquired. 17,000. Okay, sell... Sell items. And then I want to sell all of... Um, we can sell that like, Mordite stuff, because I, I don't know even how I like got that. Okay. Um, we can sell the Platinum. Don't really need that. Don't really need the nitrogen, it's pretty expensive. I'm only gonna really gonna hold on to like the carbon and stuff like that. And then I wanna sell all this iridium. So can't sell any of them. Oh, and I can't sell any more iridium. Because I've sold so much, maybe? Why can't I do that then? Oh, so maybe that's just because I'm sold out on there. Okay, yeah, here we go, here we go. Oh my god, 39,000 units just from the, what's on the ship. Wow, we are now loaded, guys. We've got 66,000. That's probably like nothing in the grand scheme of things, but for right now, to us, that is a lot. Um, In fact, I wanted to see. Do we buy it from here or not? We need the... Oh, what is it we need? Man, I always forget. To, to make the hyperdrive, we need something else. I might know it when I see it. Um, no. Uh, instant ejector shielding sheet. Dynamic resonator. That's it, I think. Well, let's just buy it anyway. I'm pretty sure it is. There we go. There we go. Um, construct the hyperdrive, dynamic resonator one. Oh, I need iridium now. Are you kidding me? And I've got, have I got none? It literally sold all of it. So we need to go and get some iridium. Okay. <laughs> well, that's typical. But we at least we know like it's so easy to get now. Come on, let me out. Whoa! Look at that ship. Jeez. That is massive. Wow, man. Looks like there's a lot of different ships. There's that, like, bug-looking one. 
Oh wow, she's gone. Okay, never mind. <laughs> right, let's get back in the ship. Go. Uh, I kind of want to go back to that red planet. You know the one we were at last time? We should get out of here. Whoa, there we go. Okay, I don't think it's that one. That's the one we've just come from. Yeah, you discovered this. Um, oh! <laughs> Let me just boost away from the space station so I know. I really want to go to that blue planet there. Oh no, that's the one we've been to. Okay, there's one around here somewhere. Where's this big red planet? Nasty looking red planet. Uh, you discovered this. Unknown planet over there. And what's that one? You discovered this as well. And that's the one we've just been to, is it not? No, that's an unknown planet. Hmm. How far away is that? That one's like a million. And if we look over here, that one looks closer to me. Uh, unknown planet KS. That's in a different one. Well, let's go to that one because it looks slightly closer. I'm just going to boost over there, guys, and then I'll I'll see you here in a bit. Oh, man, I'm, I'm a bit off course. <laughs> I'm going to have to redo it. Anyway, I'll see you guys when we're just coming into that atmosphere of that planet, so... See you in a sec. Okay, guys, we're almost here. Five seconds, four, three, two, one. Let's disengage and fly in. And... Oh, oh no, maybe I need to do it a bit longer. <laughs> I thought it would have just cut me off. Oh, there we go. There we go. Pulse engine offline. Planetary influence or something. Okay, so I was wondering if this planet was going to be like all water because it was so blue, but it looks like it might just be icy. I don't know. Can we boost in? There we go. There we go. Planetary approach. And basically, we just need to find one of those, like, outpost things. Or... Oh, oh, it might be water. It might be water. Oh, wow, it looks like it is. Okay. Well, let's be really careful. Let's just set her down somewhere. If we can see some of that uh, heridium, that would be great. Let's just have a little fly around. Oh, wow, this is going to be so cool, like, exploring, like, an ocean or something. I can see all the rocks in that below. That looks awesome. Um, it does look like it's kind of icy, unless that's like the sand or whatever. I don't know. Um, hmm. I was hoping an outpost might be a bit easier to see if there's not as much land. But I'm not seeing anything yet. Let's do a scan. No, it didn't really tell us anything. Need to keep an eye out for them big glyph things. Whatever they are. Uh, I'm just trying to keep an eye out for a, a question mark right now. Uh, ooh, what is that? A gold? It might be gold. Hmm. We need heridi- Ooh! 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 What was that? What was that? What was that? Oh! Oh! There's one! There's one! Okay, wow, let's- Um... Oh, and there's like another one, is it? No, what is that? Well, we'll set a ship down here anyway. Let's land. Oh, God, a bit wonky there. <laughs> okay, wow. So, temperature of the planet is mild red. Oh, my gosh. I think we've seen them sort of things before. Oh. But it's different. It is different. Okay, cool. Are the trees different? Yeah, it looks like they are. Huh. Oh, there's a thing right here. Oh, wow, are they? Let's just scan these. New species. Awesome. Can I get my gun out now? Please. I can put the light on, but why wouldn't it let me get my gun out? I don't know. Damage container. Yeah, we can take that. Um, oh, I should have sold the rest of that. Search. Oh, I need an Atlas Pass, whatever that is. Cargo drop. Uh, shielding shard, that's pretty good. Um, they look dangerous. <laughs> Whatever that is. Um, 
Hmm, there's that strange thing. Let's go, let's go check out that alien thing. Wow! It's like a platypus thing. <laughs> awesome. Uh, there's my ship. Ow! What? Oh, it's a damn plant thing. Stupid plant. <laughs> Why can I not change back? That's really bizarre. I don't get that. Okay, scanner is recharging. Oh, jeez, look at that thing. That is weird. That is nasty looking. Okay. Bizarre creatures on this world. And they're all like screaming away like <laughs> mad. Right, well, where's that thing gone? It's like. Oh my god, will you shut up? <laughs> Okay, let me just run over to the other side of this hill then, guys, and then we'll we'll know where where it is. Um, I can't wait to get in the water though. Oh, milestone accomplished. And it should be just here somewhere. Drifter traveled 10 ks. Uh, is that it? Ah, uh, man, that goes really far down. Look at that. Huh. Uh, I thought it had like the blue like symbols on it or something there. Hmm. Or maybe it's just whatever it is. Ah. Uh, no, I'm pretty sure this is it. It's just some weird like element then. What is it? Red. <laughs> There we go. Oh, this is that all it was? I just had to recharge it. Are you kidding me? Um. But this is charge though. Press R2 to activate. But why won't it activate? Like, I'm clicking it and press R2 to activate. Huh. <laughs> How bizarre. I do not get this, guys. So what is this? Iridium. Alright, okay. Hmm, well let's like jump in the water and let's, let's see what's going on in, in here. Oh, wow! Is there any like fish around? That would be really interesting. Can I scan these? Oh yeah, wow. Okay, cool. So this is one good thing, like we do get money from scanning things. Wow, that's cool. I'm using my jetpack out of the water. Awesome. Wow. Like glowing coral and stuff. Amazing. Oh, there's Deridium down here as well. I'm not seeing any life though. Hmm. Typical that it's night time as well. No, at least we got the torch on. Huh? <laughs> Look at this. Oh, it's got like starfish on the side. Oh. Um. Yeah, I'm not seeing any life on here though. This has been pretty, pretty boring. <laughs> pretty boring planet. What is that one? Is that different? Looks like it, yeah. Huh, new species. Let's see if it's friendly or <laughs> dangerous. Oh, what? Oh my god, it looks sort of like humanish. <laughs> that like lion face. Oh, oh no, don't do it. Don't do it. It's gonna try and kill me. Oh, jeez. No, oh, I'm sorry. I didn't want to kill it, but man. Yeah, go away. Oh, we killed it. We killed it. Oh, that's where I got mauled out from. Oh, man. It's got like a turtle shell on its back. Strange. Um, Yeah, one thing I looked up as well is that when... Wherever it is. When you like kill stuff and mine stuff, the sentinels come over. And if they get angry, they will attack you. Because you've like destroyed too much. And then... Like, if you kill loads of them, you start getting, like, a wanted level, and then, like, more of them come after you. 
So, we need to be pretty careful about that. Um, oh god, <laughs> jet back then. But yeah, I'm not really seeing anything else. Maybe we'll just get in the ship and carry on. I just don't get why I can't use my mining tool. Let's just charge that with some thamium. Starship. I don't know what I'm like missing. Um, is it broken or something or damage potential? Hmm, that is interesting as heck. It's fully charged. So why can't I do that? I might just look at that real quick online and find out why why I can't do it. Um. Oh wow, what is this? Tech. Oh wow, we need to remember to like do this. Communication station. Huh. Oh man, I like totally forgot about this. So what if happens? Oh that just displays my hood. No technology activated. Multi tool, no. Um, I do not get it. Um, but at least the sun's coming up. Right, let me just try and like figure this out one second, guys. And I'll be back soon. Oh, wow. Okay, guys. So I just found it. <laughs> People are just saying, like, press triangle. That's all it was. Okay, that's... So we don't have to... We don't have to bother with the down any... I thought, like, the whole down arrow thing was, like, how you navigated it, but... So triangle swaps between bolt caster and mining tool. Man! <laughs> how did I not even know that? <laughs> Okay. So, uh, oh, I need a hazmat glove. Wow, look how bright that is. <laughs> That's crazy. Uh, right, so zinc's around here. Need exotic laser for that. Okay. Let's get back in the ship and, like, keep looking for any outpost or anything like that. And then, I have no idea how long I've been recording for. <laughs> With all this, like, stopping and starting. But if I find an outpost, that'll probably do us this episode. Um, of course, I need heridium though, don't I? So I guess we should be looking for some heridium. But that's not really doing it for us. Uh, heridium. I'm not seeing any. I can always go back to that other planet at least, though, and uh, and like find some there. Oh, what is that? Oh no, it's just a like a rock formation. Oh, there's some. There's some. There's some. There's some, let's pull it round, land the ship, there we go, get out, and let's mine some of this iridium. No free slots? Oh man, got to keep an eye on that. Okay, well, we've got a lot of carbon there, I guess we can put the nanite clusters up. Uh, yeah, let's put that up, let's put the... I guess the shielding thing up for now. We don't really need that. Put the junk up. Because I should have sold that before. But let's just get enough of this and then make the hyperdrive. And we can probably like test it out here in a bit. I just need 200. I've got 115 right there. And oh my god, there's critters. Oh my god, look how many animals are here. What on earth? There's so many. Wow. <laughs> this is like the most we've seen. Jeez. Okay, let's just get a bit more of this. No, I think I'm scaring them with my mining. <laughs> okay, so we've got plenty of iridium. Let's install technology. Is it on the ship? How do I make it? Starship. Uh, hyperdrive, here we go. Yeah, build. Wow, now we need to charge it. What do I charge it with, do you think? Hyperdrive, so it says on the side. Uh, maneuverability, hyperdrive range. 
Hmm, I don't know. What does that say? Used to like power the hyperdrive or something? No. Um, hyperdrive systems through the galaxy map, starship warp speed, and jump between neighbouring systems. Wow, that's going to be so good. Um, well, I'll do a bit more research on that then, guys, and I think I'll leave it here, because this episode's gonna, probably going to be pretty long. And, ow! <laughs> the last couple have been longer than I wanted, really. So... But it's, it's so interesting, there's so much to, like, do. <laughs> It's really good. Anyway, I hope, you, I hope you're enjoying this series, guys. And uh, I'll leave it here, and we'll tune in next time to see what the hyperdrive does. After I do, probably do a bit of research like, off-camera. So thanks for watching, guys. See you again soon. Bye-bye.